overview of the project. The spindle speed, the rotating direction of the cutter, the cutting depth and the feeder are the most crucial parameters of the milling operation. The spindle mechanism is the most vital component for a machine tool because uh, its dynamic properties influence the ability to cut the entire machine tool directly. In order to refine the design, current research is expanded by the use of dynamic analysis. So for the objective that we want to achieve for this project, first, to design a spindle shaft uh, that is easy to use and suitable for milling machine. Second, to understand how the milling machine works and last, to obtain additional knowledge about milling machine. In order for our spindle shaft to be considered successful, it must meet the following criteria. First, simple to manufacture. Second, to long design life. Third, our design for spindle shaft complete on time. And last, achieving the desired stress, top, and bending moment for spindle shaft. Spindle is a rotating shaft with a fixture for holding a tool in the milling machine. Spindle shaft serves as a support and a rotary drive for the milling machine. From our research, we found that the study can be separated into two groups. The first one is a simple spindle that using analytical method to model a simple structure of the simple spindle which is not suitable for industrial application. The second spindle group is suitable for industrial application such as high-speed milling. This group of spindle can predict the natural vibration and also the frequency response for the specific spindle design. Material for spindle shaft is important because that design exposed constantly under fatigue load and high stress. Material used for shaft is the steel. Steel is an alloy of iron with typically a few percentage of the carbon to improve its strength and fracture. The main properties of the steel is high strength, can withstand the larger force without breaking. The secondly, hardness. Hardness measures how much it resists friction and abrasion. The third is toughness, refer to the ability to absorb energy without breaking. And lastly, weld weldability, uh, easy for material to be welded. To produce our design, we use Autodesk Inventor 2021 to sketch to make the 3D drawing and also for the detailed drawing. Uh, for stress analysis, we also use this software because it can analyze the mesh better. The primary load carried by the spindle shaft is torsion. An optimum design of spindle shaft is preferable, which is cheapest but still consider all the above load requirements. So for the next slide, we will show you some animation on stress analysis. As you can see, for the bone misses stress, which means that shaft will lead or fracture, is at 986.6 MPa. Uh, and after that, for the first principal stress, the maximum value for bending and torsion is 774.6 MPa and 1082.77 MPa respectively. Finally, the third principal stress, the maximum value for bending and torsion is 179 MPa and 270.76 MPa respectively. For calculation method, according to the stress analysis, the range of safety factor is between the range 1.83 to 15. Therefore, a high safety factor of 3 is assumed to be used. Since the primary load of spindle shaft is torsion and bending, the allowable strength is calculated to determine the maximum stress that is allowed to be applied on a structural material. The maximum shear stress can be acting upon the shaft can be determined with the known value of torque applied and the shaft diameter. Maximum bending stress developed in a shaft subjected to bending moment is given by the moment of inertia of cross-sectional area. Discussion, the design of the shaft must be studied from the following point view of deflection and rigidity, which is bending deflection and torsional deflection. Failures in spindle shaft are usually caused by torsional stress. The design should be based upon the yield strength. So based on the calculation criteria, the range for safety is 3 is to be assumed. Next, for the torsional strength, the value we calculate for the maximum shear stress and bending stress are smaller than the allowable stress. Therefore, the design dimensions are acceptable. 
To sum up the everything that has been stated so far, the aim for this project was to design a shaft to our particular chosen mechanical application and we choose spindle shaft for milling. The measurement was carried out for shaft subjected to torque, bending moment, combination of torque and bending moment, uh, axial loads in addition to combination of torque and bending moment. The results were excellent and comply with normal design rules.